Well, we are getting closer to the start of the new school year. For many students, they are going to start the year learning remotely. And for some, that first day of school is tomorrow. NBC Forest Eric Halperin is in Grandview Heights, where school starts on Monday with distance learning. And Eric, how is the community really feeling about getting back to the books? Jennifer, there's a lot of different feelings around the community right now. Excitement from both students and parents, along with some nervousness. Though some of those first day of school traditions tomorrow are, of course, going to look a lot different. We caught up with some families at the park who were out walking on this first day of school eve. There won't be walking kids to school on the first day, and there's not that same excitement of seeing friends you maybe didn't see all summer. That's because the district here is starting the year with distance learning. Some families did tell me they still plan on taking a first day of school picture, though, and this all comes after the kids have already been home since March. That's been challenging in some ways, but families say they are ready to get back to school, even if it is remotely for now. Well, I'm still pretty excited because, I mean, I haven't really had much to do at home, so this gives me, like, something to do. I don't feel any nervousness from my kids. Um, I feel nervousness in the community from the parents because uh, hopefully we, we present uh, an atmosphere of, hey, this is the way we're going to do it. Um, it's our apprehension, but hopefully we don't reflect that or give that to the kids. I kind of want it to happen, but I would uh, really like to be in a, a school room. Oh, I just I just miss the feeling of being in there. And the superintendent posted a message earlier this summer saying he is deeply saddened they're not starting the school year in person to start, but says they are listening to the health experts taking their advice and that he is hopeful they will be in the classroom this year. Local for you in Grandview Heights, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4. All right, Eric, thank you.